welcome back Miraculous fans to another live reaction with Hungry Harmony. Well, turns out Miraculous has a special. Great. Shanghai special I think is one of my favorite ones and the winter special or Christmas special. No, that's what's called the Christmas special. New York special is my least favorite. As many of you know if you see all my live reactions to season 5, season 4. Um, yeah. So I want to share, guys, that uh, I have been sick for the past weeks, um, trying to get over a cold, the phlegm, the <sighs> trying not to die, not get a fever. So it's been hard to recover. Um, but also, I've been trying to um, do some rewatch with Miraculous with season one. However, YouTube hates me, so it's like, oh, great, thanks, guys. We had a copyright from all the different, all the countries of the world, except for like maybe the three countries who I can actually see my stuff. So uh, uploading rewatches for season one may take a while. So that's just an update there. But yeah, so about this special, I did not see any. Well, I didn't see the trailers. Trailer, trailers. I don't know if there's like more than one. But I haven't really heard anything except the only thing I could guess is the way that the title of this special is. It sounds like my guess, my theory of this special is either we're gonna go into an alternate universe or someone made a wish and everything's upside down. So, cuz Ladybug, Shadybug, or even like Ladybug and Cat Noir look like opposites on themselves, like literally emo kids, weirdly enough. And why are they designed this way? I do not know, but I have a guess that if this is an alternate universe, I have a feeling that, uh, this is quite interesting, but uh, I have a feeling that maybe it's gonna be the opposite. And I'm just confused, because <laughs> if it's the opposite, like superheroes are now villains and villains are now heroes. I'm really concerned that this is the case, though I don't know if it's like, again, if this is an alternate universe or someone made a wish or something happened that to Ladybug and Cat Noir that they became villains and then now whoever is Monarch, Hawk Moth, Shadow Moth, Scarlet Moth. Actually, I don't even know when the timeline is because the garbage that I got for the season finale of season five is just the worst thing ever and I don't know if this is coming after that or is it in between. I'm not sure. It's confusing. If you have not heard my wonderful, just so excitement of the season five finale, just check it out. Just check it out. If you have not heard, just check it out. My thoughts on season five and how much pain I've gone through, which gets me to result of Miraculous is just going down the drain and it's hurting the reputation in my opinion um, what they're doing to one of the greatest characters of all time in my opinion, which is Cat Noir and Adrian Like putting him down not making him human. Thanks guys. Thanks. Thanks for doing that I'll have to go through therapy for the rest of my life again Actually, no, I just need to go to Hungary. That's my therapy <laughs> uh, but jokes aside and how terrible season five is uh, at least one season finale whatever I'm going off topic but this special I have no idea what the timeline is but I'm just gonna guess we're just gonna go to the OG of just maybe Gabriel's still I don't know alive I'd like to say like if this is the events before season five okay I'll see it that way which I think it is because I th I think I might have uh, accidentally seen a sneak peek of Gabriel with a smile and not like an evil smile, like a smile of a different thing. So, you know what? You guys have been writing in the comments too, how excited you guys are all to check out my live reaction to this. So I'm sorry for keeping you guys waiting, but I'll get started. The last thing I'll say is just the theories of, I think we're in an alternate universe where Ladybug and Cat Noir are actually the villains. And maybe if it's, if it's Hawk Moth, I'm gonna go with Hawk Moth. If Hawk Moth is the, the hero, I'll be like, what the frick happened? Like, what did Master Fu do? Unless it's like opposite day, like literally they're in an alternate universe that it's the opposite of them. So it's not really like a, a set, another dimension. I mean, it could be. I mean, we had Phineas and Ferb across the second dimension, which I do like Phineas and Ferb. Uh, but with this, with Miraculous, like maybe it's just like the evil version or like everything's flipped. The heroes are villains, the villains are heroes. What does that make all you? Villain, I guess. I don't know. I promise you guys, not gonna keep you guys waiting. Let's get started with this. Miraculous Ladybug Special Woo 
Uh, guys, I haven't even started the episode, but this is the first thing that came out. Yeah, I think it's opposite day. What the frick happened to Paris? I mean, if this is like the evil version of Paris, or not evil version, but like everything's upside down, like literally the heroes are villains and villains are heroes. Oh dear. Um, maybe, maybe not. I'm not sure. It could be like, oh, something happened and, they, and then the heroes turn villains and then, then the villain turn hero. I'm not sure, but already just seeing this, Holy miraculous. Okay, let, let's go, let's get started. In the daytime, I'm Gabriel. Just a normal man with a normal life. But I have a secret I must What the? Cost. I'm done. I'm, nope, 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 no, no. What the? What, what is this? What, 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 well at least we know Gabriel's alive, so this is not after season five, unless it's, unless it is, unless it's a different universe, then that would make maybe sense, but, whoo, um, yeah, this is definitely not a kid's show. Did you just see that? What, I need to go back, and also, he's singing again. What did we talk about this, Gabriel? What happened, what the, actually, no, I told you not to dance, so you're not dancing, but what? In the daytime, I'm Gabriel. In the daytime? <clears throat> I mean, we have a theme song from Marinette, and I created a song for Adrian. I didn't expect something for Gabriel. Wow! This is good. Oh dear. I'm sorry. One more time. In the daytime, I'm Gabriel. Just a normal man. You're not a normal man, but what the freak? What? You have that hair, man! I mean, okay, I'll be completely honest. He looks really like a good guy. Like, he actually looks okie dokie ish. Like, he actually looks not bad. Like, he looks like a carefree tailor, like, like fashion designer. Like, he looks. I mean, just look at those eyes. And that smile, he actually looks like a good person, honestly. I, I, I actually... What? <laughs> normal life. Normal... Normal life? D no, you do not have a normal life, but if I have to erase everything that I knew from you, Gabriel, from season one all the way to season five... Oh dear. It's like the same thing that happened in what special? Or what was it? Forget everything? But I have a secret. I must... Okay, how is this? This image? A for kids show, it's not! Look at that! That cry! That cry! And Emily just... And she has the brooch in her hand, that's what it was the indication of. What the heck? And that detail! Okay, I'm already gonna forewarn you guys, this is gonna be a very long episode and I'm gonna hate editing this for the longest time. Okay. Oh, but look at that cry. That's just beautiful artwork right there. Beautiful! Because you can see the pain in his, well, glasses, but in his eye and his and his facial expression and just seeing this, yeah. I mean, I already knew from season five it's not, and season four kind of like it's not a kid's show, but this is like, whoa. Keep it any cost, or all hope will be lost. What the frick? Yes, you can change. The power of love will free us all. Miraculous. I'm sorry. I think I am sorry. <laughs> I think you should go for more of the miraculous. I mean, I can't go though because I'm I'm a female. I don't really have the the Adam's apple to go deep. But pff, I would kind of get. I don't know if there was harmonization. I don't know. But what the heck am I watching? This is so weird. But I want to go back. I'm sorry, guys. This is gonna be interesting. Oh my gosh. Wait. All hope will be lost. Look at that outfit! Also, it's not really, if you're trying to hide your identity, no, <laughs> we can tell it's you, Gabriel, because of the hair, if that's what you look like in the civilian form. But actually, never mind, it's magic, it's magic. Keep forgetting Marinette with the pigtails. But, okay, but the singing, what? Miraculous, fear is a cage. Fear is a cage. 
cage. Okay, can we just, just, can we just appreciate the cuteness of this right now and Nuro actually being happy? Look at that happy quad, look at that joy. We need that in real life. Hear the message and serve the cause. Interesting. Also, Adrian, wow. Are you doing the same hairstyle as I am kind of literally? series? Like the half these, half these kind of thing? Oh, you're an emo kid right there. Okay. So, Alia and Nino joining forces with Hawk Moth. Wow. Okay, I literally am thinking, I feel like this is a fan fiction, honestly. The power of love will free us all. That's actually a cool line. However, what the heck, the butterfly, like that, the, the butterfly, the, the Akuma still looks evil, but I'm guessing that's just the, it doesn't matter. Um, but interesting. So, oh. My freaking gosh, they are the freaking villains. I mean, look at those evil smiles. Also, I think I know what that is right now. Those symbols, the red looking symbols that we saw from the beginning. I think that's the symbol for the miracle box, but it's altered. Like that we know what the miracle box single symbol looks like, but this is the, I'm guessing alternate universe version of the miracle box. So interesting, there's something in my eye. Um, but I'm, I'm, I'm hooked. I'm hooked! Honestly, I feel like I'm reading a fanfiction or watching a fanfiction, but it looks awesome. Uh, <laughs> the butter. Hello and welcome. You're tuning in now. Today's main event is, of course... But this is canon! The on Paris. I mean, for me, New York special is not canon still, but this seems to be canon to the right. Luckily, Ladybug and Cat Walker saved Paris yet again. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's, it's, I'm not making fun of it. I just I'm enjoying this right now, but it feels ridiculous, but not in a bad way. Alia looks like she's aged like 20 years. I mean, look, look like Alia looks like an as her, like I feel like when she's an adult, honestly, more emo adult. But Gabriel, what the frick? But he less, he does look less evil. Like that's kind of cool. Is it ready? Can we make the jump? There's a 92.7% statistical chance of landing in a world where these source images originate. Max? You know. I'm sorry. I can't stop them. They're coming. We don't have a choice. Fly, my Kamiko, and magnify the glimmer of hope that shines in Alia Sasseir's heart. Ubiquity. I am better fly. I give you the power to connect to the pet. I am better fly. Oh, wow. Wow, I'm actually really good at pausing. Look at that. That's. I'm guessing that's Shady Bug. Wow, I paused that perfectly. No, I just want to say, like, I am better fly? So you're not Hawk Moth, you're better fly. That's actually kind of cool. I like that. Usually, I mean, I was still stuck up on Alia calling her Scarabella. I, I prefer Lady Luck. I had a dispute about that when I'm watching the episode. But this, I'm like, better fly. Sure. Hello, world. We have located so we can find help. With this gift, I am exposing you to many perils and placing a great burden on your shoulders. Do you accept it for the greater good? I do. Oh, okay. That's what I thought. I saw a picture of this and I thought, I'm like, that's definitely Alia. But it was weird. I'm like, I don't know what I was looking at. You know. What? What the? Okay, I see what we're doing. Shattered universe, or alternate universe. Who are you? Oh, Ladybug or Shadybug? A 
I'm not sure. Miraculous World. That's pretty cool. Oh, I like the design. After months of battle, supervillain monarch, who once went by Hawk Moth as well as Shadow Moth, has managed to seize the miraculous that Ladybug had been guarding. Monarch now threatens to attack Paris relentlessly. We're heading straight for disaster. I knew it. I told you. Shh, be quiet, Mark. You're gonna jinx everything. <laughs> <laughs> Fortunately, the people of Paris haven't lost hope and faithfully show their support for Lady. So this is the events right after season five, episode one. I thought we already got that episode. No, it's not. It's not. Wait, 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 no, but he has the... He got hurt. So is this after... Episode three? But I thought... What? Yeah, that just happened. I mean, not just happened, that's episode three. I th yeah. When you were trying to find who Lady... Where's Ladybug? This power is so heavy, Plag. I feel like I'm losing control. I feel the same every time I see a slice of so nectar. It fades away eventually. For real, wow. Black, what if I ended up destroying everything around me without even meaning to? Deep. Sometimes destroying is the best path to build anew. Trust me, it's worked for me more often than not. You really showed some self-control, Marinette. You, you think? Of course. You didn't get the Kwamis back, but it's only a matter of time. I know it. I mean, in my opinion, you monologued. You monologued. If you just didn't monologue, you didn't, you, you could have just, 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 oh, yeah, it was, what, don't, you were just, you were, uh, villains monologue about their incredible plan and their evil plan and how they're going to take over the world plan. But heroes don't really do that until they defeated the villain for sure. Maybe. Not all villains or heroes do that. But you just monologue. You could have just, don't wait, take. That's going to be literally my quote lot apparently but now i see where the timeline of this is let's go <laughs> beginning of season five was epic it's when you told us that adrian was not human and here was I when everything was ruined and other things of course powers, chloe and lila you don't even need me of course i need you the one superpower you'll never lose is the power to be the best bff ever <laughs> aww after months of battle, supervillain Monarch, who once went by Hawk Moth, as well as Shadow Moth, has managed to and as well as Scarlet Moth that Ladybug had been guarding. Monarch now threatens to attack Paris relentlessly. Oh. Did you hear that? Oh. Really? Tiki, you can be more sneaky. Monarch has all the miraculous. I don't think I'll ever stop worrying. Mm. Ladybug's already got one back. Before you know it, everything will be back to normal. Back to normal. <laughs> you have season five finale. <laughs> I'm not sure I can do it this time, Alia. Monarch's got all the miraculous and Cat Noir and I. It's just the two of us again. I feel like I tried everything. I just don't know what to do anymore. Marinette, it's normal for you to have your doubts, but you can't give up hope. Alia? Alia? Oh, yeah? <laughs> Wait, I thought her phone was already- What the frick?! Ah! <laughs> oh my gosh! Literally! Literally! Marinette cannot get a break! Poor girl! She cannot freaking get a break! Oh, that is so sad! I mean, seriously! Seriously! No! Monarch was just in a room, like, literally probably like 20 minutes ago, and now we got- Better butterfly. <laughs> Poor internet. Sorry. I'm just like, I'm sorry, girl. You got another adventure in front of you. Also, did you just took take over the will of Alia? Dude! That's kind of um using Alia. Hopefully she'll be okay, but seriously, they just used Alia from this universe. Who 
Holy frick! Forgive my intrusion, young lady. Please, don't be scared. My name is Butterfly. I need someone to lead me to the holders of the miraculous of the ladybug and the black cat in your world. Ladybug and cat no more, but I don't know how to find them. I, I don't know them. I'm just married. Interesting. Sorry, I'm just thinking because Alia could have been anywhere and Monarch would have, or not Monarch, sorry, Butterfly would have teleported wherever Alia was. So the coincidence of Alia being, of course, well, not coincidence, it's very high possibility that Alia was going to be with Marinette, but also the coincidence of timing. Like, imagine if this happened at school. <laughs> the, the, <laughs> you know, they're all at school and suddenly just <laughs> kind of thing. Um, but imagine if they're at school uh, or anywhere else. But this is just, I mean, I'm guessing for story's sake, for convenience sake, like they made it so that it just happens like perfectly right there. But yeah. Just a normal girl. I beg you. Please, they're my last hope. I'm not sure there's anything to hope for from Ladybug. <sighs> Marinette, what just happened? You transformed into... Ubiquity. In the universe where I come from, Alia Cesare's my ally. She connected her power to you in order to open a gateway between our two worlds. Uh, uh, is this another one of Monarch's schemes? Monarch? <laughs> They made me open again. I can't hold them back for long. Run! You can't stay here. They are merciless. They made me open up again. Oh, so that's the other Alia talking. <gasps> they took Max. Or robust. <laughs> Max, your sacrifice will not be in vain. Max from a different universe. They literally just killed Max. They are merciless. Wow. You know what? I think this this set special is definitely for the people who grew up with Miraculous from the start. And, you know, it's been like, what, seven, almost to eight years since Miraculous? So, like, eight years later, yeah, they're adults. This is for adults. I'm, or especially young adults and older teenagers. Like, imagine if you started, you know, when you were maybe even like 10 years old, 18, 8, 17, you're 17 right now. Wow. This is dark and I am not complaining. Says most adult, young adults and like teenagers, they kind of like a little bit of the darkness, but literally they just killed Max. There, you can have your boyfriend back. Now it's being put to good. Seriously, guys, what's wrong with you? Even in this world, we find pictures of that self centered Adrian aggressed. Well, obviously, he can only be perfect here, too. A perfect, stuck up rat. No wonder you're a fan of his. They must have gone out this way. I'd rather go out with a bang! <laughs> oh my gosh, I thought you were gonna cataclysm the whole house, and I'm like, if you kill best dad and best mom. Gonna punch in the face. No! Best mom! Stay! And you are right back. Don't move. Okay. I feel like I need my staff for this. It's butterfly. They tied me up. You carried out your mission perfectly. Thank you for everything. I release you from the power I gave you. Huh. Wow, that's Everything awesome. Okay, girls? Uh, we're fine. Everything's fine, Miss Dupain Chang. We just, uh, we started playing a video game and the sound was too loud. That's all. Very well. Don't stay up too late, okay? Sure thing. No worries. Oh, yeah, you best. <sighs> Remember, your phone was already damaged when Monarch showed up. Already, he damaged it. Yep, I do that too. So what is he guys' goal here? He could be anywhere. The city is so big. We'll never find him. The city is Oh, it's not like negative charm or something like that, or like karma charm? This time. A butterfly tracker. Kind of. These binoculars can detect butterfly pheromones. 
Their smell, in a way. Don't bother pretending to have a smart plan when all you have is luck. And what's your plan besides showing off and destroying everything? Ah, there it is. That's just the butter. Oh, it probably goes back to its master. If we're having like a, like assassin version, of these villains of Blade and Kenmore, it's crazy. Here where it's safe. No one should suffer because of a battle that isn't theirs. Uh -huh. Thank you for your help, little Kamiko. That's not an Akuma. An Akuma? Uh, Ami Kamiko? They're just so cute. Also, run. Are you okay? She used her lucky charm. I prefer intentional harm. More direct. But not discreet, and even less clever. He can't be that far. Booger fly, we know you're hiding here. He's... We'll turn this lousy world to ash! I'm sorry that you got involved in this fight. Please, take care of yourself. Stop! The people of this world haven't harmed you! You know what to do this! Hand over the miraculous you stole! Stole? Are you okay, Marinette? I'm more invested in his guy's no. universe than this! Marinette, did you get away from that super villain? I think he's a holder of the miraculous of the butterfly, Alia, except a superhero, not a villain! Look around you. A better world than ours is possible. The only thing I'm interested in looking at is your destruction. And your imminent defeat. <clears throat> so these are... They're the holders of the miraculous of the ladybug and the black cat from one of the billions of parallel universes in existence. And those two are not very... Tiki, couldn't you have said that before? I don't know, like in season one? Or, okay, at least I'm in season one, but at least in I don't know season four? Three? I love Tiki just like, oh, in the billions of universes. I'm like, isn't that a big problem, Tiki? Just, 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 Tiki, isn't that a big problem? They have the same powers as Cat Noir and you? They're the holders of the miraculous of the ladybug and the black cat from one of the billions of parallel universes in existence. And those two are not very nice versions. Parallel universes? Why didn't you tell me about this? Exactly! Just I've lived for billions of years in every single one of these universes simultaneously, and there simply aren't enough hours in your lifetime to tell you even the tiniest bit about it. So, I choose to stick to the basics and make the most of the time we have together. The Supreme is Okay, that's fair. I'll, I'll take that, Tiki. Oh, that's fair. You shouldn't have stolen the miraculous from him! The Supreme abuses his powers. <laughs> Power must be shared. Is Master Fu the ultimate villain? Let's go! Using the power of the miraculous draws vital energy from the Kwame, but also from the holder. So there is a security system to protect those who are still a little too young. Like you and Cat Noir, you transform back before it becomes dangerous for you. But for them, they use their miraculous for evil purposes. It overrides the security system. No more automatic detransformation. But the price to pay for that is terrible. Terrible price, okay, which makes sense of... Honestly, why can't we get this episode as a season 5 episode? Seriously, this is... Real, I'm really invested. Great storytelling in my opinion. Like, this is this is going great. And also just makes sense how Gabriel didn't have that thing, but of course the explanation we got in great episode 24... Not 24, it was 23. Yeah, it was 20... Oh, I dropped something. Um... Yeah, I think in 23, it's just, just like, like, now they're like, oh, but you're, like, I'm an adult, I don't have to. Well, they're adults! I'm like, yeah, when they upgraded so they don't have to ever detransform after, like, you know, five minutes later. But interestingly enough, I wonder, like, what's the price of this? Because it's bad for them not to detransform. Don't let my parents go into my room before Ladybug's fixed everything. You can count on me. Thanks. Tiki, spot on! Let's go! Trapped like a bug, you ugly butterfly. Join the resistance. Everything can change. This world is the proof of it. It's not too late for you. Uh, do you know her? The resistance ends here with you. Uh, what in the... Yes. Let's go. I never thought I'd ever say this, but let go of the butterfly, ma'am. Another polka dot bug. The name's Ladybug. Whatever, pest. Hand over your miraculous. They shouldn't be used for evil. Only for the greater good. 
Ugh, how corny. Ugh, I'm gonna barf with a hairball. Okay, emotistic. Bring it on! Yeah. Bring it on! Way to save her. Go better, better fly. Let's go. Cat Noir, come on, defeat your. Yeah, we go, boy. Still best boy. Let's go. Oh yeah, he is. We better than you, that oh, emotistic boy. Okay, and he's, excuse me guys, suicidal. Frick. Superpower police, that's a thing in your world? Weird. Ladybug versus Ladybug. Oh no, I'm so scared. Why do these Akumatized heroes get all the magical powers and we don't? You'll get it later, buddy. In a weird possible way. What are they? They're Shadybug and Claw Noir. And who the cat are you? Betterfly, it's an honor. I know. I'll explain everything to you later. Okay, Chloe. Hmm. Nice. Smart. They're gonna wish they were back in their world faster than a whip of my tail. You know, interestingly enough, they try to summon things to help them destroy. But when Ladybug does it, she summons everything that whatever the Miraculous summons. What? Hey, what are you? Celeste Cat, I am Betterfly. No, get out of my head. I'm not your enemy. I only want to entrust you with the power to save us. How do I know you're telling the truth? I don't know you. I only work for the greater good, like you, Celeste Cat. Do you accept this gift I am offering you for the greater good? This is. I do. So beautiful. <laughs> Let's go! Angel shot blonde! Let's go! Oh, this is beautiful. I want to see Adrian. It is an angel. Remember that episode when he jumped off and they would give him angel wings or something like that? No, you won't. Ooh, too bad I was this close. Uh, uh, uh. You tried to work together. Try that again, <sighs> bag. Oh, okay. Wow. Man, I'm so invested in this. So if anything were to happen to that butterfly. I have to pull myself together, Emily. Yeah, have you not felt the negative energy this whole time? Dude, come on. But not as much time. You cat! Oh now you do. Why are you always trying to steal my miraculous? Like you never try to steal mine! I'm just trying to get rid of you, flea bag! I'd be better on my own. Oh yeah? Yeah, yeah. I feel a dual source of anger and despair. The magical jewels of the ladybug and the black cat may finally be within my reach, my love. The wrong ones, but sure. Nuru Kalki, dual metamorphosis. Hmm. Fly to these hearts that are as black as mine. So I like this special because it actually goes with the actual season. The other seasons, seasons are kind of like random. Like it could be anywhere almost. 
<laughs> you didn't make me so angry. Butterfly wouldn't have detected our emotions, Kitty Cat. Uh, don't get angry. Uh, <sighs> mm -hmm. Fine, fine. Let's calm down. That's hilarious. So then, what do I we love do this. now? It's a good thing I still have a brain. And a lead. Is it just me or just like Claw Noir almost like his back hair looks like Spike? I don't feel the emotions anymore. From MLP. Or my Megakuma. Dark wings fall. That was fast. <laughs> no, it's a good version. It's a good version. What? She's freed herself. She can't be far. I thought it was the good version. I thought the bad version had a different kind of colored yo-yo. Where do you think you're going? Stay here and help me search for a clue. If the portal between our worlds opens here, there must be a reason. You're not the boss of me, Detective Cockroach. Ugh. Okay, comics. Yeah, no, you're gonna get found out soon. That's the sad thing. is so different, so beautiful. You help each other, your partners. In mine, any form of mutual aid is a crime. Yet, you use your miraculous for good. In my universe, ordinary people don't even know about the miraculous. It's a secret. They all belong to the Supreme, who uses them only to perpetuate his own power. The Supreme? The so it is Master Fu. The who rules the world where I come from. How did you find out about the miraculous, if it's a secret? Sometimes, he entrusts them to the powerful of my world. All of whom have sworn loyalty to him. I too was a part of this corrupt system. In order to get something I wanted more than anything. I stole two. But I misused them. I hurt the people I love. This is amazing! This is fantastic! Keep doing, keep going. I am loving this special. I might agree with the people who comment down below. This may be even better than Shanghai special. To redeem myself, I became Butterfly because, like a moth, I have no choice but to fly in the shadows in order to give people hope. Someone has to show them that we Batman. must revolt, that a better world is possible, provided that power is shared between all. Oh no. <gasps> Don't read the... But my real name's Ladybug because I'm lazy in every single dimension. I wish you were Clan Noir because he's the real cool cat. Mm. Hm. Reading a diary, find all the secrets that she's Ladybug. Dear diary, I can't believe I made such a blunder. I'll just die of shame this time for sure. I had a presentation to do with Adrian, my Adrian. Ugh, how can anybody be so disgustingly sweet? What happened to you? Do you need uh, a hug? Cat Noir, we haven't known each other for very long, but it feels like we've been together forever. Oh, Ladybug. Oh, now you'll figure it out. Of course. I should have known. I mean, like, we've been fighting villains together, right? Because there's absolutely nothing between us. He's just my partner. Uh, my teammate is what I mean. This is all season one. Oh. Now that I've seen That's all I gotta be talking about season one, honestly. Definitely not season Tokyo, four. And you can help me reach it. You know, our world isn't all that perfect. The one who holds your miraculous here uses it for evil. And he just stole the miraculous I've been guarding. If I can't manage to defeat Monarch to save my world, how can I possibly help you save yours? Because the values you stand for are good. Because you are the positive incarnations of Shadybug and Claw Noir. It may seem like they have more power than you. But they don't have your strength, because they know nothing about trust and friendship. I should be as distraught as you. In my world, I'm hunted relentlessly. No one believes in heroes. Everyone is afraid of the Supreme. I am so lonely. How do you keep from giving up? I hold on to the one thing I have. Hope. The hope for a better world. The hope that people can evolve. For a single decision that can change an entire lifetime. Black, do you think that the other holder of my miraculous could be that other world's me? Oh yeah. Well, you know, 
When two cheeses are made from the same milk, they can taste very different depending on how matured they are. So, I guess that's a possibility, yes. Tiki, do you really think that the person behind that evil Shady Bugs mask could be me? Yeah. The girls are here for me, as always. They really are the best. Season three. They inspire me every day. Season three. Each one in their own way. Wait, no, season four. Sorry. Ali and me, we're BFFs. It's so amazing. Season one. A best friend like her. We're super close, you know. She's always there for me. Season four. Tiki quickly became my friend. She always looks on the bright side and restores my confidence when I feel all is lost. The first thing that comes to my mind when describing my mom is how calm and gentle she is. <laughs> Dear diary, I finally know why Hawk Moth wants our magic jewel so bad. No, <laughs> we idiot. If you bug with the one of the black cat, you get to make a wish. But for that wish to come true, there would be a oh, that changed. Day. For example, if a robot became human, then someone would have to lose their humanity in return. That's why we can never give up on our miraculous. Oh, guys, let's listen to that again. Let's listen to that again. Just, just. Come true. There would be a price to pay. For example, if a robot became human, Robustus. then someone would have to lose their humanity in return. So are robots humans? No. Humans, robots? No. Senti monsters, humans? No. Human senti monsters? No. Get it, guys. I'm talking to those who are, are just. Yeah. You guys know who you are. The universe is at stake. Seriously, you've been cataclysm, dude. They never knew that. Lucky charm. He's gonna she's gonna try to take it. She's gonna take it. Shh. Oh, my emotistical best boy. Tonight, on Never Too Late to Do Good, we received one of the most influential people in our like just... Mr. Mayor Andre Bourgeois. You looked way better in ball, just let you know. Thank you, thank you. The honor is mine. Good evening, everyone. Uh, makeup. Obviously. Yeah, he's emo. Guessed. Blots off. Blots off? Oh. Gorilla Man wearing white. Yeah, it is literally complete opposite day. Oh my, emotistical people. What the frick? Oh, so he's a stalker. Similar to Marinette. Uh, actually, I, I see. Okay, so it's reverse roles. He's, he's a stalker. Wait, makeup? Wait, 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 wait. Now I understand what he's saying. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, uh, I need to, sorry, I, I just realized. And this is very important. Wait, pause it, Don't, idiot, pause it. Go back to the face, go back. You know me. How are you still alive? Oh, it's it, it's going up to his face now. So you have been cataclysmed way more than once, haven't you? Dude, don't self-harm yourself, man. That's just sad, dude. Not enough love. Not enough love. If you don't understand what I'm saying or going at right now, but you see this, he's wearing makeup to hide the destruction that's happening to his whole body. Remember when Cat Noir cataclysmed him? But he didn't because he grabbed it, Claw Noir grabbed it and put him for himself. So he, th those marks, like same thing as Gabriel has, he has it too. It's going up on his face right now and that's why he's wearing makeup to hide it so he looks normal but it's probably spread all over his body how sad you're 
you exactly like just like our Gabriel. Dude, when someone doesn't get enough love. Never mind. Take it. Wait, 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 wait. Reveal yourselves! Oh my freaking gosh, wait, just a second. Get a better life, and I could just switch with someone else's. Tiki. Flag. Oh my gosh, that is sad. Aww. Whoever this grand master or whatever it is in this other universe. Reveal Better life? This is why they didn't release it earlier on. This is why. The one and only Mr. Banana is joining us today. What do you think of Ladybug losing the miraculous? No one cares. Stay peachy. <laughs> Good. Tom? Good Tom? call. We fell asleep. Come on, let's go to bed. Just don't look at the large hole in <laughs> that face. I feel that. I forgot my phone. That explains a lot. You sure you're okay, sweetheart? You, yes. you too? Is everything all right? Wait, maybe this is the yes. price they have to pay. Oh my gosh, they have scars too. So maybe it wasn't the cataclysm. Maybe this is the deadly price that they have to pay for, well, one thing being villains, but also just... Jump it back! Oh my. Are you sure you're okay, sweetheart? Yes, I'm okay, I... Sorry, Mommy, dear, I, I just dropped my sewing machine, but it's fine, it's just... slightly damaged. Don't worry, sweetie, we'll take care of it. Broken things can always be fixed. It's hard. sweetie, I love you. I love you too, Mom. Wish all you a good night for me. Tiki. Blots on. It doesn't cover the face yet. Get to work, Mouser. We've got to take the Butterfly Miraculous back. That's all we have left anyway. I am so invested. Flag, dagger's out. Tagger's out, okay. How come the Supreme never told us that merging our qualmies would grant us any wish we wanted? <laughs> For the same reason that he never told us that using our powers would slowly destroy us. No wish will save us. Not with your miraculous no, but with Ladybug and Cat Noir's most definitely. Invulnerability. I am Monarch, invulnerable to your powers thanks to the miraculous of the ox. And I am also your best chance at having your wishes granted. Are you willing to work with me, or would you rather keep on playing with your measly powers? Interesting. Delightful. It seems like we'll get along just fine. My plan is simple. Tiki, spots on. Oh dear. I'll try to help you, Butterfly. This is crazy. It's Marinette. Leave a message. Beep. It'd be cool if. Oh wait, no. Only Marinette can do that. Or and Ladybug can call someone else's phone with her bug phone, but can't do it the other way around. Finally, you bring back season one! Thank you! 
Oh my freaking gosh. <gasps> if you don't want us to destroy this world, then come out, come out wherever you are. You and your new buddies. I guess they're not hiding after all. Monarch must have acclimatized them. What a holder of the butterfly miraculous has done, another can undo. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> They're not akumatized villains. You think Monarch could have lent them a miraculous? Are true. you freaking kidding me? That's true? Does that work for everything? Wait for me here. Oh my god, you can't stay here. It's dangerous. Is that my mom's phone? It's a long story. Your mom is fine, but check this out. And you have Wi-Fi. My plan is Nice. I only have mobile data if I'm in the middle of the streets. <clears throat> Are you sure your simple plan is gonna work, your highness? Mirage, honestly. My plan is foolproof. They will show up. Ladybug and Cat Noir always show up in the end. My plan is simple. That's the room where I first arrived. I was there for a sleepover at my friend Marinette. Your friend Marinette? Is she safe? Yes, I made sure of that. Karen. And she's confirmed with me that she's okay. So the two giants out there are illusions? Created Mirage. to trap you by forcing you to split up. This is only the beginning of their trap, and even though Ollie have recorded it all, no matter how much I think about it, play it back to myself, I can't find any plan against a trap like this! Calm down. Lady. I mean, honestly... I know you're having a hard time right now. You may not believe in yourself anymore, but I believe in you more than... Best you boy! You find the craziest ideas, even when everything seems lost. It's like your lucky charms. They never make any sense, but they work every time. Why can't this be canon? right. Don't lose hope. I'm sure there's a solution. I like you I very much. Do have an idea. You're really going to I'm like me. Like are going to. We're all ears, Ladybug. Like you. Okay. English is so hard. First of all, the miraculous of the butterfly has a limited range. Past a certain distance, he can't keep in touch with the Akumas or the people he Akumatized. We'll need to get far enough away from Paris to be out of Monarch's reach, so Butterfly can turn Ollie into Ubiquity again. As long as we're far away, he won't be able to remove her power. That's right, Cat Noir. Next, Butterfly will lend me the Butterfly Miraculous. Light wings fall. This way, I'll create a Oh my super gosh! Specially crafted superpower designed to protect Cat Noir and I. Unify. Cute. Next, we'll hide the object into which the Kamika will have landed into the parallel world. Where it will be inaccessible to Monarch. That way, Monarch won't be able to remove your powers during the battle. Then my power will protect you from the final treacherous blow Monarch plans to inflict upon you. Brilliant! <laughs> now that's the lady. The strength of teamwork. Let's go. I'm a little confused, but it'll all come together. See? They can't help themselves. <clears throat> they always have to save the world. Maybe, but there are three of them. And Ladybug is wearing the Miraculous of the Butterfly. Your supposedly simple two-person plan no longer works, Your Majesty. On the contrary, now it will be even simpler to seize both their Miraculous and the one of the Butterfly. As for the holder of the Butterfly Miraculous, whatever he has done, regardless of his unit. I'm sorry, but you know what they could do right now? I'm, I would almost like to say maybe it doesn't matter who has the Butterfly Miraculous, either from this world or the other world, but literally all they have to do is cataclysm him or stop him and just take the Butterfly Miraculous and they can be on their way. If I was a villain. That's all. Unless they are really desperate to save themselves, that's the only reason why they're not taking it back, if that makes any sense. So their motivation is to make the wish, then yes, they do not want to hurt Monarch. But, again, just, just think it out loud. I can undo it. Oh. Oh. I'm sorry, Ladybug. Thank you for your help, Alia. Part of the plan, gotcha. You against me, giant shady bug! Giant shady bug. <gasps> oh no! It was an illusion! Don't it's overdo true. it, dummy. <laughs> surprise, ladybug. I Lady like fly, actually. the purple. Nice to meet you. I love surprises. <laughs> and red. <laughs> combination right there. Like, the color scheme is really cool. Don't do Cataclysm, just pretend to say Cataclysm or something like that. Good job. Oh, could it be that it's 
just an illusion? Oh my gosh, dude. See you soon, my dear good king. My dear good king? Interesting. Multiplication. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> I was about to say, like, hey, we're gonna have a cat fight. Aww. Are you kidding me? The only thing worse than your fighting is your clawful puns. <laughs> Go get to war! Dude, anything is possible. I literally can't believe we're the holders of the same miraculous. <laughs> <laughs> and one so weird and egotistic. You're a sly cat. <laughs> <gasps> Not the ear. How dare you? <gasps> okay, he still has an ear though. That's good. Like a season finale. Nice season five? not opposites at all. It's all about choice. And in that universe, 
Adrian in that universe chose to be a villain or chose not to let go compared to the Adrian this interesting and Gabriel was the one who let go interesting you guys heard this probably before but it's it's really crazy and realistic the hero and villain both have the same tragic backstory. It's what you do or the choice you make to overcome or let it consume you. Poor Adrian in that universe got consumed by grief and wanted to bring his, his mom back. This Adrian definitely probably grieved but did not get consumed and overcame. Gabriel overcame in that universe and moved on. But this Gabriel here was consumed by the grief of his wife and chose to hurt others the way he was hurt. Just so he can create a wish. Which is why I probably think that Adrian Claw Noir chose to serve that Master or whatever that that min great person. I think it's Master Fu. I don't have no idea. It'll be interesting to serve that to Maybe he was promised like oh, yeah, if you serve me um, Will your mother I can bring back your mother and they did not understand how or why or what how that could work Until they just found out that you can make a wish interesting But with their no qualities, you can't how much I miss her I know if you read my diary, then you know. It's not all that easy. Everything often hangs by a thread. I, too, was very angry. I, too, was hurt. I, too, was scared. And I still struggle with all of this every day. You don't need any magic jewel. Powers didn't change my life. I changed the way I saw myself. I'm just supposed to take her earrings? I decided to love myself, to love the world around me. And I decided that I could fix what was wrong in it. I'm sure that if you change the way you see yourself and your world, you'll be able to fix what's wrong with it too. Just like I do here. Girl talk. Time. You can fix it all. I feel like she would say it's too late for me. I don't want to do that corny stuff. <laughs> By doing it in a way, you'll also fix yourself. This is beautiful. If I make a wish, I'll have a chance to get the only thing I want. I'll bring her back to life. I'll see my mother again. I know. I know you, you know. No, you don't. Don't pretend to be me, or else you wouldn't be friends with a cockroach. If you were me, your mother would also be... She is. But if you knew about the wish, why haven't you tried it? I won't tell you that I never thought about it. Of course I thought about it, but everything comes at a price if my mother came back. Our mother! In order to bring our mother back, someone else would have to lose theirs. And that I can't wish on anyone. That's what makes him a hero. Me? I managed to go on living, trying to be happy, as she wanted me to. I have my friends to comfort me. I'm okay now. I'm as well as I can be anyway. It must be painful for someone who doesn't have any close friends or anyone to comfort them. Someone like me? Only you can decide not to be alone. I can tell you about my friends from this world. You should meet them in yours. You'd probably get along. Take Nino, for example. Nino? I don't think he'd want to be buddies with me considering how I treated him. He's the most understanding person I know. Just apologize and invite him to the movies. His favorite film, here anyway, is called Space Mutants vs. Ghost Shark. <laughs> it sounds terrible. Yeah, it is. Let's say it's the film with the most improbable storyline I've ever seen. And yet, you're really making me want to watch it. This is so beautiful. I'm just, I'm getting really emotional. It's so beautifully said and done and paced and paced, which season five doesn't seem to understand in a little bit of season four. I just, I just felt that emotion. It was well 
Pates, just just the two of them, both Adrians just talking to each other. It was so emotionally and well done, and even with Lady Buck, the the, the two marionettes together. Wow, you're actually fixing everything. <gasps> He's healed. Are you completely healed? This one, you completely healed. Hey, I like your new look, fancy book. It wouldn't hurt you to do the same. Can I? You're the one who chooses your costume. What do you want the new Claw Noir to look like? Oh, let's go, baby! And my takes a Yeah, and now I'll be called Furry Paw, or the Wonder Whiskers, or Maid of Justice, or uh, I just can't pick one. <laughs> <laughs> What'll be yours? Hmm, I'll call myself hmm, Ladybug. <coughs> I was gonna say Lady Luck. We're not watermelon. <laughs> that is so sweet. Alias is there, mm -hmm. if you'll allow me. What about Monarch? I feel like Monarch would come and do something at the moment. Yeah, here it is. Far from over, Lady Buck. You may have escaped me once again in this universe, but it's only one among an infinity of others. Nuru, Moriko, Unify. I would want to say, please don't ruin a beautiful moment, but you're a villain, so it's normal. Sublimation. The power of pretension allows me to choose a super ability. I choose access to any other existing universe. Uh, I'm feeling a disruption. Like, another connection between universes is opening up at the same time as mine. Monarch. Oh, but how? Duh. He has the miraculous other rooster now, and can use it to create whichever superpower he wants. Will he be able to travel across universes and attack every ladybug and cat noir in existence? I'll handle it. If anything, Bunnix should uh, interfere. <laughs> no! Too much hair, buddy. Too much hair. No! <coughs> Okay, universe where they're that I feel like that was just going to the future, but okay. No, honey, no, don't have the long hair. Nice! Nice! Reverse morphosis. <laughs> yeah, you dum dum, but that was so cool. Ladybug, I will destroy you. You and every other ladybug in all the parallel universes! Uh, no. Monarch won't be going to any other world other than this one anytime soon. And here, Cat Noir, me and our friends, we'll make sure to put an end to his reign. Even though we haven't figured out how to yet. I am certain you will succeed. <laughs> I thank you again for your help. Since... Can I just say this? Just, can I just say this? As a cool idea, I think it'll be a, a beneficial idea. Why not? Oh, I don't know. Since Monarch went to the other universes to mess with Ladybugs and Cat Noirs across the multi-dimensional alternate universes thingies, majiggies, why don't you guys stay and help? No? Stay and help to defeat Monarch so we don't have that wish and then Adrian can still be Adrian and not human? I mean, not a... not human? Can we please have him stay human? Because it's not canon in this universe. Because season five just wanted to throw his humanity out the window. But again, please, like my point across is, please stay, please help us defeat Monarch now, so that we can erase completely of the other season five episodes, so that we can just have this beginning. Please, please, I am kind of begging. Thank you, Butterfly. You helped.
helped us get back something precious that we had lost. What is that? Hope. Oh my gosh. And you two have gained new teammates. Yeah, by the way, we're gonna need a team name. Like the Supreme Movers. You know, a blend of Supreme and Removers. Get it? Get the joke? Don't get smart, Fleabag. When the Supreme figures out that we're no longer on his side, we won't be laughing. He won't be laughing either, believe me. Because we'll be stronger now that we're together. Can we have a full-blown season of shh? Remember that you have friends here. Mm. Our, uh, their and universe for you continuation for him. Wait! In our world, we always do a little something when things end well. Let's go. That's cute. That's cute. Hope it goes well for them. Bye bye, little butterfly. Why do I like that? You okay, girl? Yeah, I was just thinking. What the heck? We can really go any which way. If we hadn't found ourselves sitting next to each other at the start of the school year, I don't know if I would have become confident enough to become Ladybug. And who knows what would have happened today? You made all the right choices, Marinette. No, no. Do you remember what you told me? Not all the right choices. All that is necessary for the triumph of evil is, is that, that good people do nothing. nothing. I only made the right choices because you're a good person, Alia. Marinette. Hug it out. Hug it out. Yes! What if we made the right choice now and got some delicious breakfast? Excellent choice. And then we're gonna take a little nap. Yeah, you have not had a frickin' break. I feel so Hello, bad. Girls. How'd you sleep? <sighs> Very well, Mom. <laughs> hey, Mrs. Dupain Chang, isn't that your phone over there? Thanks, Alia. I couldn't find it anywhere. Okay. First, let her say, oh, I can't find my phone. Oh, yeah, is that right there? Brilliant. Well done. Well paced. Some things I, I could say, I'm not saying I can disagree with, I was just like, oh, okay, this is happening. Um, but overall, very satisfied and very happy about it. Why can't we have this? This is brilliant. And it was during season five. And I remember them saying like, oh, the New York special was uh, between this and this. I'm like, it didn't really show that in the New York special, what episode it was supposed to be after or this or that. Even in Shanghai episode, it wasn't really like what episode came after that or that. So it it, it wasn't. They just said like, oh, this ep this special was in season uh, three and this special was in season four kind of thing. Like, what? But this actually showed us literally the, the, the timeline of season five when it happened. And it's it, it, it was really well done. Really well done. I'm... Hats off. Literally, hats off. This was a brilliant, brilliant one. And... Again, specials... Yeah, this was, what, 45 minutes? Which is definitely way longer than we'll go. But it was very, very... I just... I just... I can't, I, it's so hard to... I'm really bad with words, but I really enjoyed it. I really liked it. And brought back the... The miraculous love I have for it since, you know, season one, two, three, a little bit of four, not so much five at the end, but but it brought back things that they mentioned in season one, which I'm saying, like, here there was no consistency. I mean, there is consistency, like, there, it's actually good, like, there was no, in my opinion, I think I couldn't catch any continuity errors whatsoever because they mentioned things that actually happened in the past and they were actually referring to it, and of course with a diary that... Uh, she was reading it just like brought back. I'm like, oh, yes, this is that starting from season one And you got a little bit of season two. So you maybe even season three four kind of things. So it's like it's, it's awesome It's awesome and Lily Marin. I cannot catch a break I Cannot catch a break because Literally the events after it was just oh my gosh Hmm, but it was really cool to see an idea of a good or a, a hero Gabriel I Really like that and it, it was hard at first to get used to Gabriel's voice being like, not sound evil <laughs> in it, but it, it, it was pretty good. I just wish we could have seen more of the lifestyle or the, the well, 
they said that they they like they don't know that the miraculouses exist in his world, but it looked like I don't know like it. And even uh, 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 Claw Noir even said like this like how are we gonna find him? This city's huge. I'm like, don't didn't you just come from the same city? Is your city not a city anymore? Like, is it destroyed? Is it non-existent? Or, which I kind of wish we could have gone a little bit deeper on that, if that makes any sense. Um, but weirdly enough, I thought it was, you know, like opposites, but no, it's all about choices. So even in this case, Chloe did not make a good choice, just still being a jerk. Um, probably in every universe, it looks like it. Uh, but I love the jo uh, jumping of dimensions scene. <laughs> Or jumping of alternate universes and seeing the comic book form and just anime version. <laughs> I was just like, yes! Ah. But also, guys, you know what's awesome? There was no Lila. Woo! Happy, happy, happy day. No Lila. No Lila. Happy, happy day. <sighs> uh, fun. Fun. <sighs> Overall, I get... I, I, I love this. I This is something I would definitely rewatch. The Shanghai special, this special, and the Christmas special, I would all rewatch. I'm sorry, New York special, you're still in the trash. <laughs> I'm sorry. There's some, I think, scenes maybe in uh, New York that was sweet and cool, but that's like, what, three? Out of the whole, like, an hour-long special kind of thing? Oh, maybe it was 45 minutes as well. But I gotta say, if almost each episode of Miraculous could be like a special like this, like this, again, this was so well written. It was so well paced, in my opinion. Like this, for me, this episode, this special, for me, felt like a season five episode, but well done, well paced. I rather, I rather wait longer for miraculous episodes to release if we can get something like this for each episode of season six, honestly because they can stretch it out really well. They can pace it. Like for me, my favorite scene in this whole thing was both Adrians having a wonderful talk and they spaced it out. They didn't rush it and even have time to laugh. And there was just a moment that just, the camera was fading out, I think, or, or, or panning out. And they were just, they were just laughing. They were just having a moment, a, a fun, like giggling time. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how to describe it. It was just so heartwarming and I and I felt it. I felt it. And it was really, really nice. And I enjoyed it. Even though the beginning was just like, what the heck is going on? Alternate universe? Gabriel was good? The ladybug got to our bed? Like what? Um, But I'm more invested in the other world's like Lily uh setting. Like, what happened? What's going on? I would love to know more and more detail. Because it definitely seems a lot darker, but I want to know who that, the leader, or their leader is, and what's going on, like, behind the scenes. I, I, oh, man, please, please. Zag Heroes. Please. I would love to watch an episode of that universe. Just that universe. Like, even, I would even, I would be actually interested if they had a whole, like, you know, a whole show. Why not? With that universe, I would like to see how it all started. How they became, who they became, even though they did talk about it in this episode, but just from the start and how that world building, I'm more invested right now in that story than I am of season six right now. I don't really care about season six at all. You guys already heard me talking about that in my season five finale. I honestly do not care about season six. There's some things I am interested, but I honestly do not care because of how they destroyed Adrian's character. Even in a little bit in season four, I just didn't realize it until like I really w went back and watched a rewatch season one to see and see how the buildup of things like they started to ruin Adrian's character and they just completely botched it in season five. And it just kills me that they did that to him. So, but again, it felt like rushed. Like, I felt like they didn't have the time. This I can tell. They had time. And it's a brilliant, I want to say, a season five episode. Not a special. I think this was a season five episode. I think it was really well done. And it would be cool if we could see those heroes again. Like, why weren't they there to help? I don't know. Maybe to help them defeat Monarch at the end, like all the heroes were like with the nightmares, like why not? I don't know, I mean, maybe they didn't think about it, maybe. I just think it would be really cool, but 
I, I really enjoy this and I'm more invested now in the next like that different universe this is literally set it or like how it works I, I'm more invested so I would love to hear from you guys what you guys th thought about this special I very enjoyed it I think it's definitely better than Shanghai but I do love Shanghai as well but as story structure and how it, the pace was and that it's miraculous it just it was really well done it was brilliant I want to say this I would definitely this is for me if I put a tier list posthumous episode for me uh if i were going for specials kind of this is definitely posthumous video shanghai for me is a posthumous video uh for one account the christmas special i mean it's it's very sweet i probably definitely put it as a great or good episode i don't know if it's possible i mean actually it's season one season two ish so i would probably put it as a posthumous because of the songs i just love the song but overall like comparing it like for me number one definitely this this one and then Shanghai and then Christmas and then I don't even want to put um, New York special even on the list because I think it's the complete I, 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 I'm sorry I just I did not like New York special it was too much too much for a universe that I that I think the fans wanted because now they added superheroes I'm like no or like Americanized superheroes like no we don't we don't need that we actually don't need that why can't everyone have just like miraculous type of powers? Like for me, it was just overwhelming. I, I think I talked about that in, um, I think maybe in my Shanghai live action, live reaction, but yeah. <sighs> Sorry for making this video so long, but again, I would love to hear from you guys, your thoughts about this episode. And I'm sorry if I brought up some stuff that had nothing to do with this episode. Sorry. It's just season five finale had a big impact on me and what the show has done with season five like finale like the last couple of episodes they did it's just it it, it kind of broke my heart because of what i grew up with was awesome and i just remember all the happy memories and 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 then i started live reacting on youtube and just enjoying it and love hearing people's thoughts and and then just learning more about about story structure in college and how it works and how to tell a great story and this and that and i realized then during even a little bit of season four and then season five just confirmed it to me that they completely forgot about everything. Just, there's, it, it, there's no consistency. There's so many errors. It just, it just really frustrated me that the show I, I was kind of blind, not blindly, but like I grew up with watching it just, it just, I felt like it, it stabbed me in the back by doing that. Uh, that's how I feel like, doesn't mean that's what happened. It kind of looks, to me, looks like it did happen that way. But it just it just really hurt my heart um, to a show that I grew up watching to really collapse like that in season five. It just it's it's sad to see a show do that, in my opinion. I know a lot of you guys love the season finale, and I'm really happy for you guys. I'm really happy. Like if you loved it, I'm happy. I can't understand why you like it, but I'm glad you do. Like don't let me take that away from you. I'm just uh, sharing my opinion of season five finale and how I felt and how I felt how I felt betrayed a little bit of the taking away Adrian's humanity. It just makes me grieve for Adrian that that's what the show did to him, in my opinion. You can definitely disagree. I completely understand if you disagree. Totally fine. We can all have our different opinions. That's, that's how I feel. And some people agree with me, some people don't. And that's totally okay. Okay? It's totally okay. No worries. <laughs> um, but th yeah, I'm just sorry for bringing up things like that, just like did now, sorry. Um, that didn't happen in this, but it just, I just wanted justification and I, this this special was so amazing and i and i loved that it. it didn't justify of course because season five finale is unfortunately canon um but it just gave me hope of like this is what good episodes you can do really well paced honestly guys i would love to hear from you guys what your thoughts on what this of course this, this special the good and the bad the pros and the cons i'd love to hear from you guys just your opinion and seriously just share on out i'd really love to hear from you guys and hear different opinions and what you guys thought I, I you already heard everything I said had to say. Um, I'm I'm really glad that they made this, and I want to I actually want to ask you guys. Would you be willing to wait if miraculous episodes were just like this, even if they are longer? They're 45 minutes, 45 47 minutes. But if an episode like like a special like this could have been a season five episode and just done that, I I would have happily waited. If I can get like a special like this to be an episode, I would wait two years even if we can get such great storytelling, such great pacing, just just like this. 
and no continuity or no consistency. Like for me, I didn't see that in this, which is why I enjoyed it so much, which is why. But I can understand why I didn't release this until after season five because of the wish, because she made it here. And that's actually an interesting theory. Why couldn't they make the wish? And I think it was because of, I feel like there was like a, almost like a firewall kind of thing, like because of what the master or whatever, who their leader is in the other dimension, just almost like, almost like put like a, a lock, like, oh, no one, if, even if they tried, like, I may, I can imagine why they gave it to him, like, just in case they found out about the wish, they couldn't make one no matter what, because it was blocked off or, or almost like a, it was like they were sealed, sealed by a magical seal or something like that, if that makes any sense. So I think that's why that, yeah, that's why they can make a wish. And I think that's why that, that the leader gave them the miraculous is freely, <coughs> like that cold's still there unfortunately uh, but I do feel a lot better <laughs> um but but yeah uh with that <clears throat> sorry um but yeah by way by that um I lost my train of thought oh um by having them then have the freedom to do whatever they want even if they found out about the wish they can't do it blah 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 I think I already said that uh but yeah, I would love to know that more about that background thing. But I, I almost want to put a petition over like, hey, if we could get like a season six with 45 minutes of each episode, I don't mind waiting two years just for one season. I wouldn't mind because this was amazing. And I, I would like to say most of you guys would be willing to wait as well. But I know there's a lot of impatient people in the world, mostly teenagers. <laughs> But I'll be willing to wait if we could get episodes like this. Please let me know in the comments if you guys agree. I would wait if I could get such great episodes like this. Because it felt like an episode. An episode of season five. I literally thought it was going to be. But of course it's labeled as a special. Miraculous World special. But honestly, I, I just felt like this was a season five episode. And it was brilliant. It was great. No identity reveals know anything like that it was it was well done and i enjoyed it this is the enjoyment i miss from when watching season one to season three and crazy things happening in season four but not gonna go into that but yeah thanks guys i'm gonna definitely end it here so i can stop talking and let you guys go but i appreciate every single one of you who have stayed throughout this whole like after reaction review that i'm giving i'm I'm really, uh, I, I'm really touched that you guys listened to everything I had to say. You guys are the MVPs who stayed this long in the premiere. So thank you guys. I appreciate you. And not just the premiere, but if you watch this episode, even after I upload it and you're right here, please comment down below the time, um, that you saw this and to, or I say this cause you guys deserve an awesome nomination. Honestly, like I, I, I really do appreciate you guys really and those who have stayed this long so thank you guys so much for watching you guys are the best please if you have not or tell your friends like comment share and subscribe to my channel to help support it i do hope to make to make more videos i do want to try to make those re-watches with season one i just have to, it just takes longer time to edit if youtube will let me would be nice Ugh, youtube hates me so much or if the copyrights do i just want to share my love of the show I care about, but no, YouTube doesn't care. So, but again, I hope to do that. Um, continuation with that is just, it can drain me of how many times I edit these over and over again, just waiting if YouTube's just gonna accept it or not. So you might have to wait. And if there's no upload, it's because of that, um, because YouTube just doesn't like me uh, or won't just give up. <laughs> Cause I don't want to give up, but yeah. Um, and yeah, share this with your miraculous friends and Hunger Harmony is just, gonna be out but remember guys be miraculous simply the best up to the test when things go wrong pound it all right let's go patrol our own city come on Izzy antlers ready